Hey guys, Anthony Hero, and in this video, I'm going to share with you five tips in Headliner, which is a cloud-based video creation app for creating unique social media videos like the ones you see here. These types of videos are called audiograms. In tip number one, I'm going to show you how to edit captions. When you use the audiogram wizard with a voiceover, it automatically generates captions in this left side panel. The accuracy of the transcription will depend on the quality of the audio. But the good thing is that you can edit these captions by clicking right into the box and making the changes. You can also change the start and the end times of the captions. Additionally, if you hover your mouse over a caption, you will notice these buttons to delete, add, and preview a caption. Now that you know how to edit captions, in tip number two, I'll show you how to use the break tag in captions. Here I've got the original caption automatically generated. So if I wanted to place a line break right here, I can use the break tag in the captions box like you see in this example below. So this is what the original caption text was. And in the example below, I added the break tag. So here again is the original caption. You can click in the captions box and add the break tag to create a line break like so. In tip number three, I'll show you how to create a karaoke style animation for captions like you're seeing right here. So here I've got a video project with captions in the left sidebar. Click the style button and in the captions properties dialog box, go to the animations tab and turn on this button. You can also change the color of the transitions if you wish. And here is how the karaoke style animation looks like once you've applied it to the captions. In tip number four, we'll talk about editing a previously saved video project. So once you create a video project, it is saved under projects. And if you edit the project, it will automatically overwrite it. To avoid this, you can use the duplicate project button and then rename the project and save a copy. You can then access it in your dashboard and open the project to edit it. And finally, in tip number five, I'll show you how to add an intro and outro to your videos in Headliner. So here I've got a video project open, and once you click on the export button, you will see these two buttons to add an intro and outro. If you click on the add intro button, you can add a video, like so. Similarly, click on the add outro button to add an outro video, like so. And finally, click the export button. Bear in mind that you will need to make sure you use the same aspect ratio of the video project. For example, for a square video, use videos with a one-to-one -one aspect ratio. Well, hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section. And thanks for watching.